Hi everyone, my name is Victoria Rashad and I wanted to make a quick video on um, tips that I wanted to, that I wish I knew before starting nursing school or just general advice if you just got accepted or you're thinking about nursing school and you're interested in going. Um, I just wrote five quick tips that I wish somebody would have told me before I started. Number one, congratulations, you got in. So getting in, I think it's a one uh, uh, issue of its own. I think it's very difficult to get in. Um, it's competitive, and if you got in, they ha the school believes that they're that they see potential in you. So, um, so don't get worried. I think this is the reason why I put this one down is because I think a lot of people kind of get in and they kind of panic. They're just like, oh my god, like this is gonna be so intimidating. I'm gonna be so scared. But you got in, so the school sees that there's potential in you. So. Just remember that. Number two, do not rely on others to pass. Um, I think nursing school, if you think about it, it's it's kind of clicky. Um, it's a cohort, you know, it's it's kind of like a group of students trying to get to the end and it's competitive. Reasons I really don't understand why it's competitive, I think it's just because it's just a bunch of people with different personalities in one group. I think that's probably why it's so competitive. But personally, I don't really see the point of it but just don't rely on others to to kind of make it I think it's if you 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 got to rely on yourself because when you're on the field on working as a nurse you're gonna be by yourself in the end of the day so don't try to be that or and you also don't want to be that person that kind of leans on people to to give you advice or to give you um or give you homework assignments or just give you to lean on so in, in the end of the day don't rely on people do it yourself. You can do it. Um, I'm not saying having people is bad. I do, and I do think people like friends come in handy, of course. And uh, like it's 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 actually great if you have a lot of people. However, if you find yourself by yourself, don't think you can't do it. You can do it. Three. It may. It's a lot simpler than you may think. I think that everybody. All oh, the biggest stereotype you hear, or the not stereotype, the biggest like thing people say about oh you're going to nursing school wow good luck wow oh my god you're going to nursing school good luck like it's always kind of like oh yikes is it hard yeah is it difficult no like i find that it's kind of one of those things where i think the amount of coursework that you have is difficult but i don't think the content is difficult if you will i think there is a there like this is just a little side note if like you're not into if you're not you don't know anything about nursing but this I don't want to dive into this but there is a way of testing in the sense of thinking like a nurse and that's what they want you to do um, this is not going to be extremely difficult remember that you know there are so many people going into the field of nursing and there's so many people graduating so all of these different personalities all of these different people all had to go through the same thing so if they're all passing there's just a common theme that they're catching on to so just remember that it's not as difficult as you may think it is. Take it as face value. This is still a school program. And remember, you are still paying for the school. So if there's things that you don't like or things that you don't understand, like you can talk with your professors, you know, talk to them. I know there's sometimes there's always like, um, uh, what's the word? Uh, a grade you're supposed to strive for. You know, you can do it. You can do it. I think just the biggest thing is just to don't, to think too deep into it and I think that was like a big thing I wish I knew first semester going in. Before, understand the way you study. I think that's such an important thing because if you don't know how to study, you're gonna fail. And But mind you, don't change the way you study either. You may just enhance it, but don't change it um, unless if it's very obviously unproductive. Because here's a quick story. I remember when I first started school, my first semester, people were telling me, oh, well, if you studied the last minute, you're gonna fail, you're gonna be out of the program, you're not gonna do good. So I was like freaking out. I was like, crap, I'm a last minute studier. I'm a procrastinator. Like I that's how I got through through like everything. So um and mind you, what did you see me doing? Studying at the last minute. Did I graduate? Yeah. Did I graduate with a great grade? Yeah. So it's like be mindful that you will still just know like know what works for you and understand if it's not working for you then i would say find another way of studying but don't change it just because you're in nursing school because that's not going to help you succeed if it's not if it's not genuine 
all in all, these are just the four tips that I wish that I knew before going into nursing school and I did graduate. So these are the kind of four tips that I feel like that are really important. It's just, and like I said, you know, you got this, you moved on, you just, you got in, they see potential in you. So just remember that and, you know, just don't, it'll get difficult, but remember that, as I said, they see potential in you. You know, people are supporting you. You have family, you have friends. It may not be in this program, or may not, or may, or it may not be. It may be in this program. You have, you have the support group. Just remember that. You know, just keep be true to yourself. Know what works for you. Do what works for you. Um, don't just try to find somebody another way. Just, just find what works for you.